going on? So as you can tell, today is another haul. I've been trying so hard to be a collective hauler and to collectively save so I can do this huge ass haul for you guys. Um, but finally, I, I've just noticed the past couple days it's been getting really overwhelming. This place I went to was Forever 21. Now I'm not really, I don't really like to shop at Forever 21 that much unless they have something like, if I see something that's like, oh my god I need that, but besides that I'm just kind of like meh because it's more of like hipster style and no hate on you guys that are hipsters at all, but it's just not my thing. Um, so I just like to shop for basics there, but I've noticed the past couple weeks, months, that <laughs> their basics are like suckish for me. When I went I only got four things and the first thing I got was this star necklace. It's a vintage looking metal and it's really really pretty. It was only $1.50 and I love wearing this. It's just so simple. I got a white one too but it's in the wash. I got a normal black cami like this. No, just a normal black cami because you guys know I love my camis, you know, as you can see. <laughs> this is not the cami though, this is like an older one. Um, and they were both, I want I don't know how much they were, but I'll put the links below or I will um, put what the prices are below or on my blog. And then I just got this basic tank top that was on sale and I just was so impressed by this. This tank top was on sale for $1.99. Holy crap. It's really tight on me though, so I don't think I'll be wearing it that often. And it's kind of short, um, but that's just me. Maybe it'll stretch out. Who knows? I like to buy all my clothes in extra large or large if they're like basics because I like to be comfortable. You guys knew I had to go to Pink, well, Victoria's Secret, and they had their huge 7 for 26 panty deal. I did get that. A couple pairs of panties may not be in here because I'm wearing a pair right now and there might be some in the wash. I'm not quite sure. Also, I went a separate time and used my other two coupons and I got um, two no-show panties for basically $3. So yeah, um, but I will put all the details on my blog. Um, I just got this pink, pink, this is pink, green pair, flower pair. It's really, really cute, um, lacy polka dot pink pair. I got a zebra print one that's actually ripped at one of the ends, but I didn't do that. I got this one the second time I went to pink, my boyfriend picked it out. It has little zebras or tigers on it. It's lacy at the top and on the butt. It says, get wild. I just got this basic star one because I love stars. Stars and hearts are my favorite. Oh, there's, um, I got another one. Another pair like this, but it was kind of zebra print and it was light pink like this color. Got another one with the lace on the top. It's just basic blue and the butt says pink. And then my no-show panties, I don't recommend getting these if you're a big girl like me. If you're a small girl and these don't roll up on you, then, you know, you're good to go. These basically is like sheer fabric. It's basically what they are. Like, if you can tell, like, this is like just fabric. I got this pretty flower. And I actually wore this one. And when I did in school all day, like, the the front and the back were rolling down on me like crazy it was really bad but I love this cheetah print like I'm not really one for cheetah or leopard print because zebra print's my favorite but I just thought it was so cute and my boyfriend's like Psh, you had to get the ugly pair ugly I thought it was cute so Psh, whatever it's my ass it's covering so I don't care and the next place I went is Walmart and I went two different times and the first time I didn't really get that much stuff the second time I kind of you guys know I went crazy. <laughs> you guys probably already saw this on my Instagram, but I got a new hair straightener. I got the um, Remington Pretty Fierce, and it has this crackly look on there, but it doesn't exactly look like that, which I was a little disappointed, but it works really awesome, and I love it. My hair gets straightened so nice, and I use this when I um, did that wavy style that Trisha did, um, her Britney Spears inspired tutorial with this, and it just looks so awesome, and my waves held up, so this is what the straightener looks like. It's very thin, very, and it's pink, and it's got the little, as you can see that, it's got the little cracking, and inside it has up to 30 temperature, and I love it. It heats up so quickly, and it works so great. I just, I love the straightener, and it was only like $19, which isn't that bad, so I thought it was, you know, an awesome deal. I was a little hesitant to get it, though, because, like, I'm really hesitant when it comes to buying, like, straighteners and stuff, because I don't want it to just, like, crap out on me, like, a month after I use it. And that same first shopping trip, I just got the, um, I think I already talked about this once, I got the Maybelline Dream Matte Mousse in Creamy Natural, light number five is my color. I saw this in Trisha's favorites and I thought that the texture just looks so cool. Mine doesn't really look that cool compared to hers, but I really, really liked how the texture looked and I was like, oh my god, I need that. So I bought it. It was around $8 and to me it was worth it. It's a really awesome foundation. Like it covers up all my spots and makes me look kind of flawless, which I really like. Then I also broke down and I got the Maybelline Dream 
bouncy blush. I love this blush. And I got mine in 45 Orchard Hush. So it says right there. You probably can't even tell. Um, I love it. It bounces right back at you. Like, ready? Bounce, bounce, bounce. You can't really tell, but to me, I can. A lot of people don't like this. Mine looks like it kind of melted inside a little bit. I don't know. A lot of people don't like it because it's not really good color payoff, but to me it's like perfect because I don't like a lot of blush, so it was like a lot of color on my cheeks. So it's perfect and it's purple and it's really, really cute. Another candle. Another three layer candle you probably already know because I got one of these like back in, I want to say July. Um, this time, this one is for more like Christmassy fall time. Um, I got one. Um, it's the mainstays, and the flavors are vanilla, cookies and cream, and cinnamon vanilla, which I am so excited to burn this around Christmas time because, oh, it smells awesome. It smells kind of like cheesecake. Oh, it smells really good. It's going to make me so hungry because I love making cookies around Christmas time, so this is, like, perfect. I got one of these boom cubes that you see on TV. I thought it was really cute, and this is what it looks like. I got the blue one. They didn't have the pink one. And around it, it has this little leopard, um design or whatever. I didn't really like it. I don't really like the design too much so I might cover it up. I'm not quite sure yet but I thought it was so cute and these things really work awesome. Like my mom is a white one and we went to the lake and played it her phone on this and it was so loud. It was awesome. I really do recommend one of these. It was only like 10 bucks. Like it was really awesome. Next thing I got was just something normal. They had like a big bin of these. It was just like allergy medicine diarrhea pills, whatever, and I got, this was 88 cents, some allergy relief medicine, I have bad allergies, needless to say, batteries, so I need batteries for my remote and stuff, so I got some batteries, I also broke down, well, I ate, me and my sister have been eating this, but I got some um, candy corn autumn mix, I love candy corn, I'm obsessed, like, through and through, and autumn mix is my favorite, because it has, hold on, let me get one out, where is it, because it's got the little, ooh, I'll eat that, <laughs> Asia. And we got little pumpkins in it. It's so cute. I forgot to add this in. I'm an idiot. But also at Walmart, I got this jacket. It's kind of, it reminded me like of those like 50s, like retro um, school jackets that you would wear. And it's just so comfortable and it's so cute. Probably already saw this on my Instagram. Um, I just think this was so freaking comfy. And it was only 25 bucks, which is kind of a lot. But it was just so freaking cute. I could not pass it up. And I just thought it was really, really cute. They had this in, like, a ton of different colors. This was in, like, red, and they had this in, like, a like a dark brown or something. And it was, I thought this one was so cute. Also, when I went to the mall, I went to FYE with my boyfriend, and I got a couple movies. I got Creep Show. I love Creep Show. Like I said, I love horror movies. This was freaking awesome. I watched this when I used to live in Maine. Stephen King is a Maine author, and he starred in this. And I was like, oh, my God. And I love watching it. It's just so awesome. And I also got House of Wax. It's also one of my favorite movies. I love it. It's just so creepy and eerie and, oh, amazing. Next place I went was Stop and Shop. Well, I go grocery shopping with my mom, you know, whatever. But I only picked up a few things, nothing really special. I picked up this Wet n Wild Wild Shine Clear Nail prote Protector because I ran out of my clear nail polish and I needed a new one. Two new shampoo and conditioners because I, I, I really love my John Frieda, but I kind of wanted to try something different. These were two for six at Stop and Shops right now, so if you want to go grab that, you can. I got the Herbal Essence Totally Twisted Shampoo and Conditioner for curls and waves because my hair is very wavy. Next, I went to the dollar store and I went two different times on two different occasions and I kind of went crazy. So, let's try to sort this out now <laughs> okay first time I went to the dollar store I actually got two candles I have burnt these um, I got one in vanilla and this one's in cinnamon they smell so awesome and I just think they're so cute and they were only a dollar so I was like why not also on that trip I got some zebra print duct tape it was only a dollar a dollar for this like you see these at Walmart for like five bucks for zebra print duct tape like duct tape and freaking this is only a dollar I was like hell yeah I ended up putting it on my binder. Finally got one of these. Um, I actually got my mom one too. It's just a little Halloween figurine for my room. Um, just this R.E.P. with a little skeleton dude. And I just keep this like right next to my TV. Because I love celebrating Halloween and Christmas. Oh my god. Halloween's my favorite holiday. So, so. Kind of works. I just got these hair clips. Because I don't really have any like this. And I want to start wearing hair clips in my hair during school. So I don't, you know. Because my hair likes to fall flat. If my hair's curly. And it's not cool. These cute little mini hair clips. Oh my god. 30 in a pack. A dollar. A dollar. Like I'm really excited to use these. So cute. Got some really funky looking nail files. My sister stole one of my zebra ones. But they're really, really cute. Because I don't really have any nail files anymore. 
because um, mine are running out really badly. I got some pens, some neon colored pens, like the gel pens. I used to love gel pens when I was a kid. So I just got these in an orange and a purple and a pink. Really cute. And they actually do work. Like a lot of people think you go to the dollar store, you buy pens or whatever. They're not going to work. They work. Same goes for these. These are two highlighter slash pens. There's a highlighter at the top. Ooh. Not right there. Not right there at all. There's a highlighter at the top like right there. And then... Ooh, I can't get that back on. And then at the bottom has this little clicky thing. And it's pen and it writes in blue. And these do work too. I have tested them. Finally, I got some makeup. I usually never do buy makeup, but I was like, eh, why not? I got the Maybelline Mineral Powder Natural Perfecting Foundation with Micro Minerals. Oh, it's getting light again. And this one is in the color Light 1. I didn't know what my color was for my um, Dream Matte Mousse, so I just got Light 1. That's what it looks like. I think I'm going to be keeping this one like in my purse for touch-ups and stuff because my face can get really oily and like my face could fall sometimes. I found e.l.f. Okay, I found e.l.f. there. I was like, oh my god, they have e.l.f. here? What the hell? So I got this e.l.f. Super Glossy Lip Shine and it is in the color Juiced Berry and it smells really good and it's really, really sticky, which I kind of like. So if I put this like over one of my lip butters or whatever, it'll like stay on, which is awesome. This e.l.f quad palette and I really do love these colors that's actually what I'm wearing today but you can't even tell because the lighting sucks so bad in the color butternut <laughs> I laughed so hard when I got this because butternut if you watch victorious and the part where she accidentally you know hits jade or whatever when they're stage fighting and the key, the secret word is butternut so that automatically made me think of it and that's what the colors look like so pretty. These did come with um, little applicators, but they're in my drawer. Really funky looking palette by LA Colors Bold Eyes, and that's what it looks like. It's got like some colors in between each of them, which I really like, so I'm really excited to try this. I have not tried it yet. My NYC Smooth Skin um, Translucent Powder. It's a, um, like a pressed powder like that. It did not come with a thing, which I don't really care. I'm just going to use a brush anyways, but this is going to also go in my purse because I really have a really oily face during the day so if I have this I think it's gonna be a little bit better <laughs> then it's got a mirror so I can be like oh hey last final things I have to show you guys I bought from Trisha's store you know you guys know and I got the college dropout sweatshirt which I love so comfy and it's so warm and it's so long on me I was kind of worried that this wouldn't fit me at first I was like oh god I hope it fits but it does it's so cute and I love it best freaking $30 I ever spent in my life. <laughs> I was going to get the fake one, but my boyfriend was like, that's stupid. Why are you going to get it sweatshirts that's fake? Well, guess what? I'm going to get a tank top that says fake. Okay, girl? So you you'll see that too. I'm going to get that white tank top that says fake. Next thing I got was from a website called 599fashion.com. I love this website through and through. I am a huge fan. Um, Leopard Pink Love X. She doesn't really make YouTube videos anymore. I don't know what her deal is or what she's doing or whatever. Um, I do love her. I got a um, purse from there because my little black one was getting too small. And this is what I carry everything in, as you can hear. It's really big and roomy inside, and it has a zipper on the top, too, not just a clasp. I just use the clasp, though, because, you know, it's easier. Um, it's so cute and so flowery and florally, and they have other colors, too. I'm not sure if you could still get this, because I got this, like, a month ago, but um, it was $5.99. Everything on that website is $5.99 under. If I were you, I would get what you want, like, literally, like, that day because they sell out so quick and they never restock again, so. I got a couple things from Amazon. You already saw on my Instagram, so I can't really show you guys. I got a Hello Kitty decal for my Mac, and I got a new um, purple keyboard cover for my keyboard. And I hope soon that my solar charger comes in because I bought one for school, so I don't have to take my charger. And my phone battery is sucking, as I told you guys in my vlog, so yeah. Oh my goodness, this is going to be probably a two-part video maybe. I'm not quite sure. But if it is, then, you know, thanks for sticking with it and seeing my haul. I hope you guys loved it. Um, I really enjoyed collecting all this stuff to show you guys. It was really fun, but it was kind of a pain at the same time. Um, I think I might just start doing hauls, you know, as I, you know, go shopping or whatever. Because I think it might be a little easier. But it was really fun. I hope you guys liked this video. And I will see you in my next one, which will be on Wednesday. Yay! I love you guys. I'll see you in my next video. Mwah!